love is superior and supreme and above color. He has absolutely stated this. This is his yes. actual facts. He will not speak unless it's actual facts. Right. So when it comes to love, that is speaking from a godlike perspective, original perspective, untainted, clean, spotless, without stain or blemish, without any type of destructive past and historical understanding as to why it may be in the best uh, benefit of my people or not of my people. The reason why the white woman, brother, and you can, we can go into the anatomy, we can go into <laughs> biology, we right. can go into history, we can go into culture, right. is not ideal for the black man is because if you want to have the best of another black man, you have to have a black man and a black woman to right. have a black child. To know. No but one, even though a black no. man and a white woman can still have a black child. Speak, now you're now you're now, now you're dealing with biology. <laughs> now, 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 now you're dealing with now, which, right. by the way, because we have the dominant gene. Yeah, we have the dominant gene. So, so black, regardless, a black man is going to make something else black. Period. No matter what you mix them Period. With. Which is cultural, or not cultural, pardon me, which is genetic annihilation. Right. Now, see, now that's that's another that's another area I can go in. And a lot of people are like, okay, but come on. Yeah. But it's like, well, right now. But we can't, like, you, think, if, you know, we're, if we're speaking science, as we, gotta, as we evolve, mm -hmm. we are creating this one race. It's going to happen. It's going to go back to the original. It, exactly. It's going to go back. So, it has it, to. so, so why fight it? Because mm -hmm. so really, when engaging with a white woman, all you guys is bringing it back home. Nah. <laughs> you're nah. bringing it back home. You, well, you, like, you're allowing to create the original man once again. Nah, we nah. all gonna be beige in a minute anyway. Right, right now, now mind, <laughs> and that, now mind you, that's down the line. Right now, that's a couple hundred years, happen. couple thousand years. It's, it's inevitable. Right. Which is which is true. Right. And they see it well, according to the United States Census Bureau right now. They're saying that by the year 2042, America will be a majority brown country. Yeah, you're saying that white people are having more death than they are having births. Yes. So one perspective for other people would be, listen, I don't want to... We got to save the white folks. Right. I got to be with all the white women so I can save you. No, <laughs> no it's the opposite. I can't be with you because I don't want to kill you. Yeah, right. You right. Yeah. And that's supposed yeah, to be true. But in a nation's perspective... And, they, and that's some of their arguments as when you see some of these super conservatives and yeah. people in these certain areas there's, of these, there's of truth these to white it. nationalists, they just like, yo, we trying to not yeah. be extinct. And that's, there's truth to it. See, and so it's like, you know what? I agree with you. I, I agree with you, white man. I want to be with a black woman. Why? Because I was forbidden from loving you. I couldn't look at you or else That's I That's what made me want it even more. Look at this, look at this. <laughs> oh, I can't have you. Look at this. I'm gonna control you. See this, look at this. Look at this. See this is terrible. Y'all look at terrible. This is terrible. <laughs> but I mean, we joke, but these are the real things. It's real. One of the reasons real. why black men, it, white women are looked at as success. Because yes. in, in America, we see a white woman. I couldn't have you. My daddy mm -hmm. couldn't have you. My granddaddy couldn't have you. I mm -hmm. would get killed even looking at mm -hmm. you. People, if they thought I whistled at you, they would murder me, mm -hmm. beat me, mm -hmm. drag me down the street. Mm -hmm. So now, if I play for the NBA, I want them all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and, I'll tell you I, and I can afford them all. That's, yeah. what, that's what they're thinking. And the sad thing is, that has to do with the slave master mentality. It does. Because but we're... They, but we're we're superseding it. No, no, yeah, no. I, it's it's it's. I was your slave for this long. Mm -hmm. Now I'm gonna take your woman, and cause mm -hmm. your woman always wanted me. Mm -hmm. She all she always dreamt about. Well, me. She had you she, in the barn. Yeah, but that's what I think because she it was snuck and had you because anyway. it was forbidden. Mm -hmm. It was forbidden, so therefore, mm -hmm. now that it doesn't have to be forbidden, mm -hmm. I'm gonna show that I'm the superior being, mm -hmm. uh, I'm, I'm the the dominant original man, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna act within that. Mm -hmm. So therefore, that's why I believe at times we're like, yo, once you get money, once you get success, once you, get, mm -hmm. now I'm not following anyone else's rules. I'm gonna love who I want to love. And the interestingly, interesting part about that is, we don't want to sit here and say, well. The black woman was raped, she was murdered, she was lynched, she was dismembered, she did all these things. My child, I couldn't look at my child or sell them to another plantation. They tarred and feathered me if my woman showed any love to me. And to this day, the to black this... woman is still the most mistreated Absolutely. person on right. the planet. Exactly, and you're telling me, we went through all these different things. By the way, the white woman was largely part of that, right. uh, literally. She would help to rape the black man, she would help to buck break us, she would help to sell uh, those of us into other plantations, etc. So you're telling me... The black woman who has been there for us the whole damn time. Right. Who was there when us when we were getting lynched, who was there for us when we were getting whipped every day, who was there for us to heal our wounds, to give us consolation of mind, to bring us peace and quiet of mind, to help us to get through another day. Right. You telling me she doesn't deserve at least, and I'm not saying after the brothers, y'all like, man, I tried. <laughs> hold on, listen, listen, you didn't try enough, goddamn. <laughs> right. Just like, hold on, brother. Come on, if it's
this. If you can give up on a black woman so easily, you don't deserve no other woman because you have demonstrated that you can't give enough love to the number one who needs it the most mm. because she has been destroyed the most. Mm. She has been rejected the most. She is the number one, number one divorced, last married, most mistreated, and you telling me Facts. that because now you have money, mm. now I'm free to go mess with the same white woman who helped to keep me in slavery. Same white woman who helped to remove the black woman from the home because she needed numbers to help to get rights from her white man when we were together as a black family to fight for civilian rights. Okay. You telling me you got some goddamn money mm -hmm. and you just going to go give it not to the black woman who has been there for you, who you have invested in and she has invested in you, mm -hmm. but give it to somebody who has no connection to your own damn race, your ethnicity whatsoever. Because when you are marrying, when you are coming together, you are coming together with the culture, mm -hmm. with the people. But now we're talking about too many selfish black brothers, mm -hmm. selfish who want to come together with a white woman as an individual as though she is the epitome of greatness. She's the most beautiful. She has the best hair. She has the best everything. No, I think I take some brown sugar over some white cancer causing sugar any day. I can't have both.